This Achieva Coupe definitely doesn't qualify as your father's Oldsmobile. That's because it's one of the sportiest and least conservative vehicles that the Olds division has released in recent years. And with this newfound youth in their line, the engineers at Oldsmobile are getting even more adventurous. They wanted to see just how far they could push the Achieva's street performance envelope. The result is called the SCX. Turning a basic compact car into a pseudo hot rod is hardly a new idea in the American auto industry. But with rumors swirling about Oldsmobile's future, a successful performance car could be a real boost. The SCX is actually the Achieva Sport Coupe equipped with a W41 performance option package. But Olds gave the SCX full lower body cladding with a silver accent stripe to make sure it stood out from the crowd. A deep front bumper with an aggressive chin spoiler adds to the performance image, as does a prominent rear deck spoiler. And these attractive 14-inch aluminum wheels wearing V-rated 60 series tires. Powering the front drive SCX is a more potent version of Oldsmobile's flexible 2.3 liter quad four engine. With four valves per cylinder and dual overhead camshafts, this high output motor delivers 185 horsepower and 160 pound-feet of torque. A five-speed manual with a typical GM long throw shifter is the only transmission available. Producing good bottom end torque, it propelled the 2,700 pound coupe from zero to 60 in 7.8 seconds, a half second quicker than the standard Achieva SC. The quarter mile ended in 16 seconds at 90 miles per hour, but power is strongest between 3,300 and the 7,000 RPM red line. We expected reasonably impressive power from the SCX, but were pleasantly surprised by just how well it handled. A tuned suspension, wider rear axle, and a pair of rear stabilizer bars gave the SCX remarkably little understeer and very smooth transitions during our handling test. And our drivers rated it superior in high-speed maneuvers to other GM N cars like the Buick Skylark GS and Pontiac Grand Am GT. Like most small GM cars, the Achieva SCX comes standard with four-wheel anti-lock brakes. They stopped it in an average distance of 115 feet, quite good. There was slight fade due to new brake pads, but stability was above average and pedal pulse minimal. Out on the open road, the SCX felt even more the pseudo hot rod with a firm ride and slightly high 70 decibel interior noise level. Interior layout, however, is very effective with a driver-oriented dash placing everything within easy reach, while large comprehensive analog gauges provide plenty of important information. The cloth covering on these standard buckets is a bit more utilitarian than we're used to from Olds. Support and comfort, however, are up to par, as is the design of the efficient ventilation and radio controls. The rear seat room is what one expects in a small two-door, fine for around town, but skipped across country trips, even though there's certainly enough cargo space for serious traveling. But when Olds told us the price, we wondered if they were serious. The W41 package adds $2,475 to the standard SC model's $13,049 price. That adds up to a lot of performance for only $15,524. The Achieva SCX is definitely not your father's Oldsmobile, but it is the most potent compact coupe to wear the Oldsmobile badge in a long, long time.